previously I've posted a video called how I make my watch list and in this I took you through the process of how I go through my master list of earnings winners of every earning season and then build a daily watch list from it. So as soon as I posted this a whole bunch of you commented asking how do I build that original list. So in this video I'm going to take you through the process of how I do this every single day step by step. So this is the scan that I use to find the earnings winners. Uh, this is a software called TC2000 and I use it as my scanning and charting software. This is the only condition that I put in there and I'm gonna take you through each part of this formula and tell you why it's there and what it means. So let's do the easy one first. C greater than one simply means that the price of the stock is greater than $1. And I put this there to remove all the penny stocks. This simply means that the average dollar volume traded of that stock is greater than a million dollars. And this will vary for each one of you depending on your account size. The smaller your account size, the smaller this threshold can be. So if you're trading a five figure account, it could be uh, simply 100,000. And if you are trading a seven figure account, then you want a million dollar or more in liquidity per day. Now, there's two basic ideas to what the scan is doing. The first is it's looking for stocks that have greater than twice the average volume. So the scan for that is V greater than two X, the average volume of the last 20 days offset by one. And we offset it by one so that today's volume does not interfere with this average. And the other main part of the scan is that the stock has made a two ADR move. Uh, what does that mean? So ADR is the average uh, range that a stock trades in a day. What I am looking for is a stock that has made more than twice its average daily range. So say on average a stock trades a 5% range. This is gonna scan for stocks that have more than 2X their average daily range, or in this case, more than 10%. So um, the scan and the formula for this is C by C1, which is showing me the percentage change today, is greater than two times the average ADR. This is the formula for ADR. And these are just simple mathematical operators. And if you work out the formula, then you'll figure out why these are needed. And if math is not your strong suit, then trust me on it. And the last qualifier that I put in my scan is that C is greater than open, which means that the close is higher than the open, or that the close is in the top half of the candlestick bar. And these are two conditions that basically signify that that day's candle was very bullish. And if you want to understand what this means visually, uh, I would highly recommend the Candlestick Books by Steve Nyson, which give you a good foundation on uh, which candles are bullish and which are not. So these, all of these criteria put together give me a very short list of about 10 to 20 names that have made big moves in the day on really big volume. And that's the basic idea of what I'm scanning for. So the idea if you think about it another way, is that if a stock has made a big move on earnings, then it should have made more than a two ADR move on more than two on more than twice its average volume. Right? I've basically taken that idea and put it into a scan. 